The International Women's Day was celebrated with the Women Leaders Forum, Think Equal, Build Smart, Innovate for Change in Nibia on Friday. International Women's Day is celebrated on March 8 every year around the world as the movement for women's rights. The forum, jointly organized by UN Women and the Department of Social Welfare and the Ministry of Social Welfare, Relief and Resultment, focus on women's economic empowerment, social protection, its progress and challenges. Vice President U Henry Ventio attended the forum and gave a speech. At this ceremony, the Vice President addressed that the forum is held to point out the important role of women as a member country of UN. It has been included in Union Accord to have at least 30% of women participation in all sectors. Myanmar National Committee for Women's Affairs was established as well in 2018. Currently, Myanmar is making efforts to improve women's economic participation and achievement of gender equality in line with the Sustainable Development Plan MSDB 2018-2030 and National Strategic Plan for the Advancement of Women 2013-2020 again. International Women's Day is held annually with different themes. Today, panel discussions will be held to find new ways to advance women's economic empowerment and social protection by bringing together government bodies and private sector. GDP of the country can be increased by encouraging capable women entrepreneurs from any part of the country. The forum included a panel discussion on women's economic empowerment and social protection with key experts and game changers business fair with over 1,000 booths of innovative practices and business products and instructional sessions on women's collective advocacy, handicrafts, digital technology, youth engagement and many more. As a woman, I understand certain challenges faced by most women out there. So I would like to advise all women not to feel small and to try the best out of everything and face challenges that can occur in the future briefly. Over 1,000 participants, including policy makers, government ministries, market actors, UN agencies, development partners, and women entrepreneurs attended the forum.